radon is a cancer-causing radioactive gas that has been found in homes all over the United States and in many places around the globe. It comes from the natural breakdown of uranium in soil, rock, and water and gets into the air people breathe. Radon typically moves up through the ground to the air above and into homes and buildings through cracks and other holes in the foundation. Radon can even enter a building through well water. A home or building can trap radon inside, and according to the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, nearly one out of every 15 homes in the United States is estimated to have an elevated radon level. Radon can be a problem in new or old properties and in buildings with or without basements. For most people, the greatest risk of exposure occurs in the home because that is where they spend most of their time. When people breathe air containing high levels of radon over time, they could develop lung cancer, and radon is estimated to cause thousands of deaths each year in the United States alone. In fact, the U.S. Surgeon General has warned that radon is the second leading cause of lung cancer in the United States today. People who smoke and live in a home with high radon levels are at increased risk of developing lung cancer. Testing is the only way to know if radon is a risk in a home or building. Both the EPA and the Surgeon General have recommended that all homes below the third floor be tested for radon. Fortunately, there are professionals who specialize in radon testing and interpreting the results. Radon test kits are also available directly to the public. If testing indicates elevated levels of radon, there are radon reduction systems that can be installed to reduce indoor levels. New homes and buildings can even be constructed with radon resistant features built right in. These are just a few things to know about radon. To learn more about this or other indoor air quality, environmental, health, safety, occupational, or property damage issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.